gonna go straight for a little while. Those guys for waving to me. Couldn't really get a good look at them. In these sorts of roads where there's a lot more traffic in such a small area, you just watch yourself. Sometimes you could just go on the side like these. If you don't have sides, just stick on the third on your side of the road. You know, take the lane if you need to. That's basically it. Whatever keeps you safest. Because these are a little bit more risky. I've done them a bunch of times, so I'm totally fine here. <laughs> We're going to turn left here. Actually, I want to go take a look at this place one second. We used to go buy our pumpkins here. I wonder how in season they are. Maybe I can kind of show you some. Kind of a nice, nice little detour. Usually they'd have crates full of pumpkins is the big one. I bet you guys could see those little ones. Just showing you. There didn't seem to be a bunch of them there. That little girl's mother that you probably saw. I did know. She waved at me just now. All right, let's go. This path will take us basically to the edge of the houses of Ripon before we go into all this country. Traveling no hands again. No hands. Ah. Don't care if it's not safe, nobody's coming. It's safe when I do it. Cause I know what I'm doing. All right, let's get our hands back on there. Sometimes I just need to change things up a bit. I know when I got out here today, I was really, really getting, what's the word? Restless, I guess? When you spend too many hours inside the house on your computer, watching YouTube videos or working on stuff, if you're not interested in what you're doing, you generally are degrading. Your mind's degrading away. So you need to get outside. In my case, that's what's going on. Real life just happens to throw things aside. Normality goes out the window. Or at least normality in a house. Thank goodness I'm able to, you know, cycle all these places. Definitely does help me cope. Gets my daily exercise a bunch of the time. Hmm. Let's see. If I remember correctly, do I turn left here? Should be a park. Yeah, yeah, here we are, here we are. If I continue going down there, I might reach the edge of the houses. But I always like to go past this park over here. I live so far away from it, or 
you know, the other side of Ripon, this place is hard to ever go to. Since I started cycling a bunch, it's not, not that bad getting over here. It's very relaxing. A very nice change of the pace is what I say. Temperature feels like 75 or something. Not hot, yet there's not a chill in the breeze or anything like that. <sighs> yeah, if anything, I was feeling a bit restless trying to get out of the house today. So I'm really just chilling. Uh, wh what the heck? Look at that. Do you see that big cat thing? Look at his, look at its face. Give you guys a closer look. Jeez, that place looks good. What I was thinking is we could probably go do a Halloween ride. So you wanna, when the Halloween hours pop up on the 31st, I think that's when Halloween is, I'd be going to ride. You know, of course, if I'm not busy with anything family related on that day. If I have nothing else to do, I was thinking of taking a night ride where I can go, you know, see how much uh, trick-or-treaters I can find out here. I've never been over here during that time, so I'll probably end up doing that. On the move. Let's see, which way do I want to go today? Uh, I'll go this way? Technically, I think this is the road we can take. It goes this way, but I wonder if it's only for, uh, you know, people stopping at the park or something. <laughs> That's probably what it is. If I went left, it would have just taken me back down to Main Street. <clears throat> I'm just going to continue going straight. I really need to change things up a bunch to preserve my own sanity. No cars, no worries. Let's keep going straight. Thirty-five miles an hour, max. Well, I'm not going to be able to do that. My little speedometer thing is still out of batteries. Haven't needed to change it or haven't really wanted to change it. I might just take it off since I hardly ever use it. Not anymore, anyway. It's good to have, but you know, at the moment it just works whenever it wants to, which is like 22% of the time. Yeah, well, roundabout time. All clear, all clear. Let's continue going straight. I don't go here, I don't go in this general area that much. So a lot of this is kind of new to me. Though I'm sure I'll know exactly where I'm going in a bit. Ripon is basically surrounded, surrounded by a bunch of country areas, you know, these orchard fields. It's not hard to find where I'm at. Let's go straight. A little exploring to change things up a bit. I could probably go on by before this car. Okay. He's turning left, is he? Yeah, he's turning left, okay. Oh, look at that. Here, I'll give you guys a new, I'll give you guys a look at that. Oh, geez. We're gonna take a look. Look at all this. Oh, that looks horrible. As in, it's awesome, my goodness. Look at that. Jeez, Black Widow. Oh man, I'm so gonna have to ride over here. 31st, jeez, look at all that, that is crazy. Oh my, Day of the Dead. <laughs> my goodness, this is crazy. The Haunted Mansion, no Vacancy? Vacancy? I don't know. Let's continue, guys. This is a bike path, but I can still take this path, too.
Mm. Uh, let's go straight. If I turn right, it would just bring me next to the golf course. I'm gonna go left. Taking a drink of water. Oh, I lost my bottle cap. Time to go get it. Got some cyclists coming. Good to go. All right. Let's
me go see how much money I have. I'm probably just gonna go pick up some cookies from the bakery and chill on them for a little bit. I see. Boop ba doo ba dee and anything man. Okay. Let's go. I don't have a good view here. I know there is that person. One second, guys. Here, I'll show you guys what I got. I'm probably not gonna do much more than that, but here you go, I'll show you. Let's see, I got one chocolate chip and one peanut butter. I'll show the camera. Chocolate chip. And the peanut butter. They smell good. So I'm going to enjoy them when I get back to the computer. And of course, guys, thank you for coming along on the ride. And uh, now that I notice it, I got a punch of mine in my tire. I will have to see if that's going to leave me a hole. Because if that is, I'll have to go and fix that. As in patch it. Seems like I get puncture mine holes all the time. <laughs> Alrighty guys, thank you for coming along on the ride. We're going to turn left here. So far it doesn't seem like uh, air is coming out of the tire, so puncture mine's holding everything in, I guess. That's how it usually seems to go, and then I pull it out of my tire and pssst. There he goes. Either way, I'm gonna get home fast.
motorcycles. Bonus footage from past slip pro cycling, yeah. <laughs> Squirrel. <laughs>